all right welcome back welcome back welcome back guys yo let me tell you this Mimi is making videos all right guys may i beg you please watch the ads them maybe we can make some money off of youtube like really and truly it is so hard making money off of youtube because of ads all right so let's get into this so today we are going to talk about serato is it what in serato we are going to talk about a common thing that many djs don't know like for instance when you use a lightning bolt or some people say I got a strict bolt beside a song name inside a reaper. Yes, we are talking about it. Reason being, many people do not know so there is two reasons for this. One, Serato is mistakenly reading that song as a damage audio. Or two, no it will be this song is actually damaged. You get to me I say? So it's one out of two reasons why there's a lightning bolt there. So, for the first one, all you have to do is expo back to your wife's song. If you, if you know that the audio no damage and you listen to the full song, you realize that there's no damage way, any form of damage, all you have to do is download back to the song. Simple. You see, if the simple as that, just download it back over. If it's the second only song audio is damage you can also download back over the song you see right now me literally i do some business me i try getting some money cards really want to invest in our next our next laptop like really want to invest in our next laptop with a faster processor all right yes me have our next video for you for me and all of that all right so you're missing now you download over this song, but you might say, oh, but we have a song in a lot of crates. Bro, I'm going to teach you guys how to get the songs there. You're not going to lose none of your coupons and none of that. You might have to adjust your coupons, and yes, but I will say, we are sure now. I can, all right, I'm going to show now a method to one you can use if the song audio is not damaged and you do not want to download back a new one. I'm going to show now a method for that. So now, like me just like me just search my computer for actually a song where a um lightning bolt beside the name that is a lightning bolt is there, but the song the damage. Me have to search for one. Is it had to do it like literally had to search because anytime wait there. Sorry about this, man. Give me a quick time. Let me forget to say the change of some settings on my computer. And then I'll prevent Uno from hearing order from my computer. Alright, here it is. I will go again. This is Ben. This is a good thing. Alright. Give me just give me a little time then, my guys. Alright, so after that, we need to find. Okay, and you want to say, reason, reason. come on, then don't do me, don't do me like that, don't do me like that. All right, <laughs> all right, so we sit here now, can I start on the screen recording now? All right, bam. Message show person done. All right, guys. So we insert a serato now. So this is actually a song that is. Where am I giving you actual genre? EDM. It's an EDM song. That is this part class song. I don't know this song, man. I don't know it. Yeah, legendary song. So, this song is showing the nitrous bolt right here. So, how did I remove it? As you can see, there is one right here. So, I did the trick that I told you guys I'm going to show now. I don't want to know how it go now. Bam, follow me. 
So first thing you need to do, you need to find this song. Bam, you find it. Use the shortcut command R to find the location. Boom. After I find it, I open, I open a DAW. Which DAW I use? I use the free one where many DJs have, and that is Audacity. I did videos on this already, so you guys know the full effect of Audacity. Alright, so I'm putting in this song. After you put in it, you go file, export, export. See it there? So me give it me I give it the same name as the file that I'm going to change. So it's so time now. I'm gonna do now me export it. But you export it already you now. But the export but I never do the full steps. So may I may do this now. May I do the full steps now? Full steps may I you know. Alright. Bingo. Alright. So we'll do that now. May I go come so bam. I'm gonna find the one the next one because as me say me never do the full steps. All I need to do now. You guys can get this is optional, but I do it. It's very optional. What I do, I open this and I have a this one called tag editor. Me use it to edit the tags them uh, everything. Reason being I sell remix. Okay, yeah, so I have to do it this way. I'm gonna do it from inside of a DA double. See it? Everything is same. Alright. So now I did the savings. After I did that, I just simple drag, drop, replace. Simple. Now I do this. And this is it. Still retain the same. Analyze. Disappear. See it? No longer there. Simple as that. When you do this now, when you do this, look at me as soon as you do this, still retain the same coupons we are use. As I say, you maybe have to adjust back some of the coupons because depends to how your DAWA is set, it doesn't start on the exact audio file. You like you get a little space at the front. Every producer knows the reason for that. But now I'm gonna dive into it why. We set our DAW so and why many of the DAWs come with that set as that way. So that is one way to do it. That is a trick on the turn about. Export it over if the song is not. You get to me and say if a song is not damaged, actual damage. I had a damage version for this song. That is why I had to source over the song to get the one way no damage. Alright, how you know when a song is actually damaged? When you listen it and you hear it off, like it off, no, no, there is a half beat, but a wave line is constant, it don't constant. And you can hear odd sounds. Alright, let me see. I have enough time, can I show you? Let me see, I can find it here, so we. Don't worry about it. how this look. We need to get rid of some of them files, I look for your Alright, so we get some more peso. Alright, you see, because these songs. Alright, see, even this. This is a song I have me edit. I know say it don't have no band in it. But I look for which one I might have. Nothing in a hit. Alright, I will go to our next one. How do I do something different? We now, but I go look for the damage file. I'm going to do in a couple of minutes. You show you guys how to get rid of these one. People might say um these tracks are locked. But they are not locked inside of Serato. This is locked outside of Serato. How to fix it? Alright. You cannot use command and click it. You can angle go change the color of the lock. May I show you what we do? When I go inside our where the file is located. So, so the and in my case, I'm do command R again. Bam. After command R, you go the song there. You have got left the left click or double click depends to how your mouse is set up. Get information. After you get information, yet yes, this is the lock you need to remove. Bam. You remove the lock. You go back there. Simple just analyze over. Boom. 
Bingo. Now it's freed. Yeah, so there's a difference between you lock blue, means you lock within Serato, you mean you just use command and click there, or double click. Yeah, command and double click depends to how your, your shortcuts are set up for it. Alright, what else we can show now? Yeah, that's it. So, two different types of lock. People might ask why we have these. These are just you may not start using them yet, so I can't show no how we use them. But um these are all orange files when we may convert over into dividers. I call them divider because using divider to create them. Especially when you're a DJ like me. When me and make creates, me can't still and make one um five different creates. Sometimes it's a one create with 200 songs. I want to divide them up by segments. When we do that enough time, after we divide them up, we put them in create, I mean, creates and sub create, divide them up, and then I hit that. But we still use the dividers because well, when we are playing an event now, I'm going to use this feature inside the Serato. We say include sub creates in main folder. So we got the main folder, it divides, I go show. So I have to say, oh, I forgot to jump out here, so I go back in the next sub create now. We just play out our one straight go down. Yeah man, that is that like that me use that for especially when me build my juggling them. We like say me got one party and me build a juggling from XYZ to XYZ. Me divide them up by genres cause me play from genre to genre. So me play. So thanks again guys. Like, share, subscribe. Please follow me on Instagram. Me have remix pack out right now. I sell me have them. Just go to my Comrade store. The link is always in the description. If you don't find it in the description, just simply click on the link tree. Become a so that not want to know my description. Them, you just go and purchase. Thanks for the support. Big up everybody. Love you.